Penn State, the five-game win streak. Here's their go-to guy, and a good look there for Lamar Steven. Carr back door to Hurt, and Hurt had it rejected by Watkins, but guess who is there? Daniel Oturu. Oturu going right at Watkins, spinning and scoring. They clear out that side of the floor. You didn't force Penn State to exert a whole lot of energy defensively. Another miss from outside of Inhera with a Reese check outside. Lamar Stevens doesn't miss. Hurt getting some early minutes. He didn't play for the last seven just because of a coach's decision, but he's getting a lot of time here in the first half. Dread knocks down another one. Back-to-back -back triples for Penn State. Actually, seven times this year, Carr has played every minute. Jones off the bounce on Carr. Omersa tried to block it. Penn State loves to run with this man, Wheeler. Stevens dropping it off. Watkins, two-handed flush. And that's a rare time. Outlet up ahead to Brockington. That's going to be a short stay on the bench for Marcus Carr. Whoa. Jamari Wheeler, 41%, but he's only hit eight threes this year. Penn State with their largest lead and looking to add to it. Up 24 to 16. Stevens thought about it. Instead, he'll take the 18 foot, and they do have a double digit lead. Today, very, very cool initiative. Air ball down to Hera. Hera finding dread, and he has it swatted by none other than Oturu. Got Brockington on car in the switch. Let's see if Minnesota is able to take advantage. And Williams, very fortunate he didn't get called for an offensive foul. And Williams turns it over. Now here goes Brockington. Here's Carr. Let's see if they can get him going with a bad pass. Now it's a three on one. And it's Stevens scoring as he's fouled by Kelsher. With how he defends, it can have a cumulative effect on Oturu because Oturu's not going to get a rest. Gabe Kelsher finally hits his first three and Minnesota's first three of this ballgame. Kelsher has five points. He averages 12 a game. Part of that sophomore trio that gets 67% of Minnesota's points, and it's a freshman Seth Lundy getting more points here for Penn State. He now has his 39th game of 20 or more points. He's at 21. Carr has it blocked by Stevens on the other end, but it will stay with Minnesota. Good job by Brockington of navigating those screens and being there on the catch for Peyton Willis. Step back for Carr. Yes. Finally, Marcus Carr. Oturu's able to get good post position on Hera. He's adding to his 13th double-double of the season. Hera on the other end. How about the pass by Curtis Jones? And Oturu gets no rest on this end because now he's got to check Lamar Stevens as he has for extended periods of time today. Hera, it's a new season high for John Hera with eight. Good double by Stevens. That forced Oturu to kind of fan out. Carr, bucket yes. and a foul. That's a man-sized drive. Here's Isaiah Brockington taking it right to the rim. Strong move. How about a strong move with the right hand? If they can get a bucket here and go into the under-12 media timeout with some momentum. And they will get a bucket here thanks to Marcus Carr. Minnesota, after shooting 30% in the first half, they're 11 of 19 in the second half. Oh. And that is what Penn State needed. Oturu, two strong men doing okay. battle in there, and Oturu wins the strength battle. And the double team was way too late. Now 24 points to go along with 14 rebounds for Daniel Oturu, and Stevens throws it down. He has 26. And Carr comes away with it. Marcus Carr, great pass, and a great flush by Ali Hamdemir. What a pass. Kalsher. Setting, firing, and he got the three to rattle home. He's been on the bench with foul trouble, but a big shot there. Lamar Stevens backing down Demir, fading away. New career high for Lamar Stevens, 31 points. Kalsher somehow got that to go. Almost like it even got dislodged on the way up. Minnesota down eight here. Oturu. And now he has 32. Pitt State's going to get their sixth win in a row. In front of their first sellout since 2000.